All right, everyone. Um, I was going to walk by this Walmart, but my speaker decided to need a charge. I want you to see this. It is really coming down right now. So once again, the universe told me to stop at this Walmart. And as soon as I did, the rain started coming down. I'm telling you, people, when you listen to the universe, it's going to provide for you. Um, I have a spot already picked out for my camp for the night. Um, and once again, my speaker running out of charge is what did it. Uh, hopefully the rain stops. This Walmart closes at 8.30, so hopefully the rain stops by then. And I'm not even tired. After those three days of rest, I am ready. I am ready to uh, get going. <laughs> um, I didn't want to stop, but like I said, my speaker was like, you need to stop. Charge me up. Uh, I ate at, hold on, at lunch today. I wrote the name down just so I would get it. And I don't know if I'm going to say it right. Uh, El Camilo's. I probably messed that all up. 100 times 35 in Sabra. Um, the owner was going to buy my food. But another customer beat him to it when they heard my story. And a few, about a month, wow. Okay, I want you guys to see this too. But maybe about a mile down the road, it was uh All right, look behind me. You see all that rain coming? That's a lot of rain. I should have stayed in that shack, but I had to leave. I really did. I, w I was there too long, and yeah. But um, maybe about a mile down the road, this lady pulls up next to me and hands me a banana, two waters, and some other snacks. And all I was doing was walking down the road. She didn't ask my story. She didn't do nothing. All she did was like, come here, and handed me that stuff. I'm telling you right now, you listen to the universe, the kindness of folks, I, I cannot stress this enough, Strange, the kindness of strangers are amazing. They are so, so amazing. Um, yeah, oh, wow. Hold on. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm in awe because I want you guys to see all that rain coming down. That is crazy. I can't even see my campsite from here. Well, a little bit. I am just hoping it stops by 8.30. I really am. But it is coming down hard and fast. I might have to go through to get an umbrella, pull out my garbage bags to uh, secure my gear so they don't get wet. Um, it's, yeah. Let's see, what do I want to talk about today? Let's talk about this right here. I did this on a Facebook Live. You guys have all seen me wearing this. Look, right here. Get a good look. This here is the key to my heart. It belongs to my daughter. I am going to wear this necklace until I get a chance to see her. So I talked about that. I wrote some other things down that I wanted to talk about. I just gotta find my notebook. Oh yeah, let's talk about the Vietnam vet I met and mentored. He made a similar journey. He went from 
wherever he was at to Florida with this girl. Um, but he was telling me about this ring. He's like, we were talking about art and many, many other things. So he has this ring that's made out of a spoon. It's trench art. Him and his battle buddy each made one of these rings out of these spoons. He has not taken that off because shortly after, wow, look at these. Hold on, wait a minute, wait a minute. I, got, I gotta show this because look how soaked they are. Oh my God, they are soaked. <laughs> oh, see the things you witness on the road. But anyway, two weeks after they switched rings, his battle buddy died. And he has yet, he has never taken that ring off his finger. Now, when you find a friend like that in war, in battle, dude, they mean the world. They really do. And, yeah. And it was Reggie he gave me. I have smoked it. So, yeah. Wow. Uh, right now I am in Estabula Township. And, uh, there you go. Now you guys can see my face. But people are looking at me when I pull that down. Yeah, I have the blue one on today. I don't know what else, you know, it's a pretty eventful day, uneventful day. I probably did about 14 miles today because I was well rested. I am not, my shoulders, not even sore. If it wasn't for this rain, I could probably do another five or six, to be honest with you. Um, yeah, because Nothing on me is sore right now. Unlike the first day that kicked my butt when I did that 25 miles. Even the second day kicked my butt and I only did 13 that day. But carrying all this weight, it's, I don't know, it's definitely making me stronger. And there's lightning in the area that just popped up. So, oops. I gotta move away from my, where I was standing. Um, but yeah, in Saybrook, you gotta eat there at that restaurant. I will talk about them some more because there, that sandwich they made me, oh my God, it was so good. So, so good. Um, sorry, I gotta promote. I gotta do some selfless promoting for the channel. <laughs> Here, look, I'll even show you guys. I got this right there for the channel. Um, I do plan on redoing it. I'm gonna put silver around all the lettering because I think it looks better. Um, and once again, I wanna thank you guys for your support. I've been listening to music the whole trip because after all, music is life. Uh, don't forget to go out there and hug somebody. I say it every video. Human nature is not to be isolated. We're not to be isolated. Humans cannot handle isolation. So go to somebody, give them a hug. Obviously you can't walk up to a stranger and hug them because well, they'd be like, what the hell are you doing? Six feet, six feet. <laughs> but uh, yeah. Give somebody a hug today. Um, I'll probably upload this tonight since I made it before my camp. Uh, let's see. Yeah, basically I spent two hours outside of Giant Eagle charging up my phone because it was dead. Yeah, I get people looking like they have no clue what I'm doing. They just see me talking to you guys on the phone. <laughs> Uh, let's see. Yeah, obviously, 
This is going to be a short video. Well, I intended it to be short, but it's the normal 10 minutes. Um, I haven't seen any art today. So, my saying art is everywhere, it's kind of like, wasn't, not today. Maybe there's some art in the clouds. I don't know, if you guys see anything in these clouds. Let me know, because I don't see nothing today. Today has been a music day. Just like the last three days, actually, I've been doing nothing about music. So, music is life, people. No matter what you're going through, a song will always speak to you. Always remember that. I mean, I've heard like five new songs today that just touched me, right, hit me right here, man. Like, that's, how do they know? How does YouTube music know what I'm feeling and what I need to hear to keep going? I'm not gonna blow you guys up with songs on Facebook. Uh, but, yeah, love each other, man. Peace out, give somebody a hug today. And uh, love you guys. See you in the next video.